What would you say to a hundred in pay to look after a six-year-old boy? Although we have fads, none improper or bad, you'll obey us while in our employ. Now, girl, be a sport, won't you cut your hair short? Though artistic, it has to be shorter. We'll show you it pays, authorizing a raise to say 30 pounds every quarter. The salary impressed her, she went to Winchester, then dog cart to the Copper Beaches. With Jeffro Rue Castle, the job was no hassle, but the child won't retain what she teaches. They made her sit down in an electric blue ground while Rue Castle told comical tales. When a loiterer came to the end of the lane, she, they had her motion him hit the trail. Things started to boil, she discovered a coil of hair identical to her own. And something was sour in an unused tower where someone was locked up alone. Twas time to entreat some help from Baker Street. Holmes and Watson met Violet at noon. And Rue Castle away for the rest of the day made the situation opportune. When the butler was smashed and his wife had been stashed, Holmes and Watson came to save the day. They broke into prison to find its denizen was already taken away. But Rue Castle came back by his own dog attacked and his dreadful scheme fallen apart. Mrs. Toller confessed, got it all off her chest, rescuing Sherlock Holmes from the dark. Rue Castle had hidden his own female kid just to keep her cash within his reaches. And thus ends the tale of a villainy failed, the adventure of the Copper Beaches. And thus ends the tale of a villainy failed, the adventure of the Copper Beaches.